Yo, what up everybody? Decided to start this first part of the game over because last time I didn't do so well. It just kind of drug on. So uh, today I'm starting over now that I'm a little bit more familiar with the game and I can get through it a little faster and more skillfully. So without further ado, let's begin. I guess I'll just choose the same name that I had last time because I like it. Yup. Booyah. And then we're starting at the same castle. It looks so pretty, doesn't it? She's just gonna sleep there all day, I don't know. Is she under some spell? So a lot of times, or when you're playing this game, you kinda wanna... Oh, those guys don't give you points. I thought they give you points. Oh, that's point... <laughs> pointless. <laughs> Fighting those guys are pointless. Stay away from them. You can find the jellies if you want. They only give you two points though, but you want to head up to these bushes. These stupid bats only give you three points, but you want to get this bag that has 50 points so your life can go up. See, down here, life will go up. You can try to uh, accumulate enough points to get the attack or magic, but to start with, I would get the life will go up because you want more life, obviously. Uh, but I'm gonna fight these bats for a while and see if I can level up some more. Uh, not doing too well. Yeah, three points? Uh. I think Link is much more agile in the first game and also Ocarina of Time. One of my favorite games of all time. Played through that game, like, every year for a while. And then got to a point where I beat it with three hearts. Oh, points! I don't care about the life. I don't know how many points I got, it didn't show. Why are you going faster all of a sudden? You know what? I like jumping over those beasts because I hate dealing with them stabbing. Ah! <laughs> ah, they just like keep going. They don't even notice you. They're like a train. That's a good strategy. Stand there, let them hit you, and then time it just right to where you can because they'll hit your shield and then you'll swing your sword and kill them with one hit. Okay, well, anyway, let's go to the first place. Second place, because you went up to those. I don't know why I always like jumping over this sign. Ah, I hit the sign. Okay, so in this village, there is somebody. Nope, that guy's pointless. You could walk around. Okay, yes, this lady in this red dress will heal you, which is invaluable. So if you wanna just run around and level up very slowly, you can do that and then she'll heal you up after you get hit the many times you probably will. Can't go in the houses unless their doors are open. Okay, so there's this lady who comes out of her house. You wanna talk with her. She says, talk with my father. Okay. I'm just gonna really speed through this, I think. I wanna go back to that castle. In Parappa... Desert... Desert? Oh, yeah. Desert is spelled D-E-S-S-E-R-T because it's super sweet. I learned that in high school. Or is it... No, I think I actually learned that in junior high. Definitely junior high. Alright, so we just got an ability from that old guy. Which, uh, drastically reduces your, uh, damage. I mean, the damage that you take. Okay, so right after that, we'll go up here. I wonder how much these spiders give you. get you one of these times. <laughs> Two points?! Forget that! This game is so stingy. Okay. This cave is really dark, but you can get through it. There's only like one bad guy, and he's right there. Man, I'm getting really good at this game. I'm actually not really this full of myself. I just sound like it because I'm... Oh, crap! Ah, 
We had more points. 50 points! Yes! Down here is like a heart piece or something. Oh, and the bubbles hurt you. Look out for the bubbles. Speed run. Oh, that was close. This game is trying to be Mario. Mario mixed with Zelda. They don't really mix well. Okay, go to the right. That ex oh, that was a cheap shot. Come on, man. 20 points. That was a cheap shot, dude. Couldn't even move yet. Okay. Going up to the castle. Oh, these stupid bubbles again. God damn it. Really? Okay, don't fall into the freaking water. So don't hit the bubbles at all, or you will probably fall into the stupid water and die. I hate having to run back through these stupid things. This game sucks. Ugh. But I can't quit it. Because... Ugh, the stupid jellies. They're so worthless. God, that level was worthless. Okay, here's the temple. Oh, I'm gonna dominate this thing now. Oh, I'm one point from leveling up. Okay, these things give you no points, so there's... They're... Don't want to use the same joke again, but they're pointless. Ah, oh, I need the key. I forgot about that. Oh, there we go. Okay. Man, I want that attack so bad. If you can, you want to level up that attack because there's some knights in here that are really strong. Okay, those skeletons give you quite a bit of points. I like those skeletons. Because they're not too difficult to defeat, but they give you 30 points. These jellies suck. They don't give you enough points, unless you're like two points away from leveling up or something. Okay, now I can go right because I got that key. Boom. These skeletons, don't waste your time with them. If you saw my last video, then you know why not to mess with them. They're just so annoying. I was really bent on killing it, but then I just, it, it's not worth it. Come on. Oh, attack, baby! So where do I think I'm going? There's a skeleton right here. Oh, it only took three hits to get him. That was nice. Again, stay away from those stupid orbs. Nice. Um, I think... Oh, okay. I can use that. The fairy could be of uh, some really good use, I guess. Okay, so you want to head up this elevator because there's a key up here. These guys are so freaking worthless. They do nothing but slow the game down. They're If they give you points, that would be nice, but they don't give you points. So what's the purpose? All they do is add to how long it takes you to get through this stupid thing. Oh, crap. Dang it. I should have gone right then. And here we go. Come on, die. Ah! 50 points. Oh my god, the next level up for attack is 500. Man, I don't know if I want magic yet. Uh, I'm going to wait till level up to get uh, life. Um, so I've got two keys now. And these stupid bouncing guys. What the hell are, even are these things? They bounce around like they're on freaking pogo sticks with a knife just sticking out. They have little to no animation. Can't hit them in the back because they're constantly moving. And Link has to stop completely in order to swing his stupid little sword. 
I'm gonna backtrack a little bit, go this way, because I think I grabbed two keys. So I think there's something that I'm missing. Oh yeah, this stupid elevator, forgot about that. Man. So I go down that first elevator that you come across, and I hate these things more than anything. Oh, come on. Then you got these worthless jellies. Okay, now this bridge, what you want to do is run as fast as you can, but there's a point thing right in the middle of it. Oh yeah, that is the definition of skill right there. Right when I get hit by the jelly. Booyah. Okay, the very first treasure is a candle. A candle. What the heck are you even supposed to use that with? I guess you can see in the tunnels. Wow, I'm about to die. Swear to God, if I die from these jellies, I'm gonna freaking flip out. At least I didn't get a game over. And jump over both of these guys and just keep running because they're stupid. Uh, if you're low on magic because you used your shield, uh, if you have lives, oh my God! Are you freaking kidding me? That was that was a cheap shot. Okay, so you want to head all the way down, over to the right, see if you can kill this guy. You can block his sword attacks. They might want to think about using your magic, actually. Points. 200 points. Wow. That's a lot. I'm going to get more life because I really hate dying. Magic will be next because then you could use the shield spell more. Oh, I guess I leveled up again. Okay, I'll just level up magic right now. That's awesome. Oh my god, come on, man. Oh, I need one more point and I level up. I guess I should have killed those jellies. Whatever, I don't think I need the... Oh, this guy will level me up. Gotta find a good gap. That was it right there. You really want to wail on that guy. Perfect. Magic will go up. I don't have any... I only have enough points for magic, so I guess I'll get that since I could use my shield. Okay. Going up to the final boss here. Fight! He really packs a punch, so you want to... Uh... Come back in the screen so I can hit you. Link sounds like an old guy when he gets hit. Okay, I think I'm gonna get him this time. So jump, hit him, run away. Because you do not want to get hit with that mace. Come on! What the heck? There we go. Ha ha! Death on you. All right, here we go. So you give some random gem to a stone or something. And then you get your life refilled, level up the life. Gonna have too much life. Oh, there's no more temple there. I guess it crumbled with like right after defeated the horse head guy. Oh, cool, so this is what the candle does. This is the tunnel I was in before, but now the candle's lit up the entire thing. That's a very powerful candle. All right, well, that's it for today. I'm going to go on to the next temple now, which hopefully should be a little easier to figure out. But uh, see y'all next time.